Well, hello, hello, hello. It's your friend Grandad Louise. <laughs> the star of the show for Christmas. Yes, and we Hi, are folks. doing BPL Game Week 19 predictions, aren't we? We are. We yes. certainly are. Guest appearance. Guest yep. appearance by one and only. And this is being filmed on Christmas Day, so there's no look back. Well, we've done the look back because I've just put a cutscene of it in. Haven't I, Dad? Yes. I have. Definitely. So, predictions-wise, last week was a very good week. I got 10. Dad got 7. However, results-wise is another matter, so we'll just leave that one be. Uh, don't mention any results. I think the Arsenal fans would be very happy with that, and so will I. So, yeah, back to the video. We haven't had a drink yet. Yeah, no. there's no hat of shame today, but there is for Christmas apron. Yes. Yeah, so I think you've kind of lost, really. I good. I see. Why am I lower than you, by the way? Because you, you should need, you need to move the thingy up. Oh, right, OK. You press the button. I'll press the button. Crystal Palace versus Swansea. Crystal Palace will win that 3 1. Okay, I'm going with a Crystal Palace 2 1 win. Yes, 2 1 to Crystal Palace. Everton versus Stoke. Granddad, go. Everton will win that 1 2 1. Uh -huh. um, I'm going to go with a 1 all draw for that game. Mm, you pinched my score again. I was going to say 1 all draw. Um, I will go for a. <coughs> Two all drawing. Most important game of the week: Norwich versus Aston Villa. Dad, go. Norwich five, Aston Villa one. Okay, right. Um, Norwich two, Aston Vanilla nil. Norwich three, Aston Villa nil. We're optimistic this <laughs> week. Let's go. Right. Um, what hey, for if we don't win this match, we're doomed. We're back to the. <laughs> oh, here we go. <laughs> we're all doomed. Support. Dude. <laughs> right, okay. <laughs> Watford versus Tottenham. Brenda, go. A two-all draw. I'm going to go one-all. Uh, I'm going to say it's a two-one win for Tottenham. Um, West Brom versus Newquay Castle. Dad, go. Um, two-one to West Brom. Brenda? West Brom, Newcastle. West Brom should win one-nil. Um, I'm going to go two nil to West Brom. Arsenal versus Bournemouth. Dad. Uh, four one to Arsenal. Wow. Uh, Granddad. Bournemouth are just sort of recovering a little bit from a very poor start, so maybe they'll only lose two one. I'm going to go two nil to the Arsenal. Manchester United versus Chelsea. Big game, Dad. Nil nil. Usual disappointment from these big games. Yeah, at the start of the season, you'd have said neither of the two managers that were there would have been sacked, but one of them has, the other one is clinging on. <laughs> and so I think they're going to need a performance, man, you. I think a one draw would be a performance in that game. I agree with the star of the show, one more. Yes, hey. <laughs> right, West Ham versus Southampton. I'm going one all. Uh, Southampton on a bit of a poor run at the moment. Uh, I'm going to say that's going to be a 2 0 victory for West Ham. I think they'll just about manage to draw with that match 1 1. Right, again, a big game here. Leicester versus Man City. One mm. we'd have thought of the season would probably be a 5 0 Man City win. If you predicted Leicester to finish 1 2. Yes, on paper, on paper, it should be almost a draw. A banker's draw. In real life, Leicester might just straight through one. Um, yeah. I'm going one all. I'm going one all. Yeah. Oh. Right. Wednesday the 30th of December has the Sunderland versus Liverpool in store. Well, that should be a Liverpool win, so I'll go for it 2 0. This was the game of the famous beach ball incident with Darren Bent. Do you remember that one? Yeah, don't worry. <laughs> it, it was very um, funny. So I think it will be a shock 1 0 Sunderland win. No, I don't think so. I think the Sunderland will be back to their usual, usual ways. And I think Liverpool will be back and forth. I think that's going to be a 3 1 victory for Liverpool. So that wraps up this week's predictions. So I will show you our fancy football team to start this week. No, 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 now, won't we, Dad? How are we getting on? Um, we are doing all right. 
obviously I haven't seen how he did the last week, but we're about, well not doing alright really. Are we above the table yet? We'll get there, we'll get there, we'll get there. We'll get there. Are we in the bottom three? Not quite. Not quite, not quite. quite. <laughs> not quite. We're no. doing a kind of what we're doing a bit of a Bournemouth at the moment, going from near the bottom and we're getting there. Just getting there. Okay, well that's our predictions this week. I've been very honoured to be with Johnny Louise and uh, David Louise. David Louise. <laughs> David Louise. <laughs> And I would just like to say thanks all for watching. Please tick the like box. And if you're really, really feeling generous this Christmas, subscribe to Young Johnny here, the star of the show. Now, just a quick word to say that our next predictions will be Saturday, January the 2nd, my birthday, and I am nearly 35. <laughs> so, once again, it's goodbye from me. Goodbye it's goodbye from, from him. And it's goodbye from him as well, so goodbye. see you again folks, bye! Goodbye! <laughs>